widely recognized as a paragon of leadership and a champion of change, His Excellency Jamaz bin Abdullah al Suhaimi was that rarest of men, a legend in his own lifetime. With his clear moral compass and personable nature, Jamaz, as he preferred to be known, touched the hearts and minds of all those he came into contact with. Exhibiting all the traits of a great leader, he was a true visionary and innovator with strong strategic foresight and business acumen. The professional career of Jamaz spanned more than 45 years and embraced senior positions in both government institutions and private sector companies in the Kingdom of Saudi Arabia and the Kingdom of Bahrain. I first came to know Jamaz in 2004, a great leader, when I was appointed one of the first five commissioners of the Saudi Capital Market Authority. He was an ardent advocate for what he believed was best for Saudi Arabia and the different institutions under his leadership. Personally, I found his unique leadership style a great motivating factor. As first chairman and CEO of the Capital Market Authority, Jamaz spearheaded the development of a properly regulated capital market in Saudi Arabia. Jamaz was a true legend with a unique set of traits and skills that are rarely found in the same person. He was a visionary leader, a strategic thinker, resolved doer, and a real passionate for change. He was a true champion of change. At the same time, he has been humble, patient, passionate, and extremely generous. My first asso professional association with Jamaz goes back nearly 30 years ago to 1989 when he had recruited me. Actually, he had persuaded me to join him to set up a new and modern institute of banking. He had the ability, remarkable ability, to identify and empower the right people to turn a compelling vision into reality. Had he played chess, he would have been a, a grandmaster. Always many steps ahead of everyone, and his eye set and focused on the end game. His death, God bless his soul, would drop GIB and the regional financial industry of a true legendary icon. Appointed chairman of Gulf International Bank in 2008, Jamaz will be remembered as the architect of GIB's new sustainable business model and strategy designed to transform it into a leading pan-GCC universal bank. I came to know Jamaz Abu Salman first as a regulator and then as a chairman and subsequently a valued mentor when I joined the bank. A true visionary, he really stood out as a leader innovator and strategic thinker and was very clear about the next chapter in GIB's strategic and business evolution. Jamaz was very ambitious for GIB, always looking at the long term and determined to preserve the integrity and reputation of the bank at all times. Personally, I found him very supportive, whether on the phone, in person or at board meetings. Firm but fair with everybody, regardless of rank or status, Jamaz was truly somebody to look up to. I really will miss his invaluable counsel, his unique out-of-the-box approach to business and his wonderful sense of humor. I knew Jamaz as a firm advocate for strong risk management framework and culture throughout GIB, and for that matter, across the regional banking industry. He was extremely knowledgeable due to the wealth of experience in the financial services sector and fully up to date with latest uh, market developments and geopolitical issues and trends. Jamaz was a true visionary and a key driver of GIB's strategic development. And I consider myself fortunate to have known him and worked with him. Something you will find commonly said about Jamaz is that he was a pioneering and an innovative individual. He had very high exacting standards, but at the same time he was practical very down to earth and very human. He had a true passion for GIB and its success was really important to him personally. 
During the financial crisis, I witnessed board meetings where they were reviewing GIB's financial future, and for Jamaz, there was only one way forward, and that was to save the bank and place it on a firm footing for the future. He had a two-step approach to this, which involved firstly addressing the fundamental problems of the bank, and then developing and driving forward a sustainable strategy and business model. I think in conclusion, I would say for me, it was a rare privilege for me to work with Jamaz, and I know that although he will not be at the head of the table at our board meetings going forward, Jamaz is in the DNA of GIB, and he will be with us in spirit at the board meetings for many, many years to come. As these tributes illustrate, the enduring legacy of Jamaz encompasses his pioneering contribution to the development of the regional financial services industry and his outstanding leadership of GIB, together with providing unique lessons in leadership and setting an example for personal integrity. In decades to come, this will likely prove to be the most important legacy that Jamaz left behind. May God rest his soul in eternal peace.